Hello everyone, I'm the AV Archivist, and today I'll be guiding you through Blissbox's convenient firmware update process. Blissbox will work with almost all controllers right from the get-go, but we're always adding new capabilities and expanding compatibility. In the 1.56.1 firmware update, one of the controllers we added was the Sega Master System's HPD200 Paddle Control. It's a pretty cool dial controller that's needed to play a few Sega Master System games. Until now, no adapter has supported this controller, so let's get our Blissbox firmware up to date and make history. First, head to the download section of the Blissbox website. I put a link for it in the description below. Once there, download both the Flash tool and the latest firmware release. With your adapter connected to your computer, run the Flash tool. On your foreplay, you'll find that there's a small, square, reset slash upgrade button beside each of the four HDMI ports. By holding one of these buttons down, it forces the associated port into upgrade mode. What we need to do now is firmly press and hold the button down for the port we wish to upgrade. While holding the button down, click Find Device, and the Flash tool should announce that the Blissbox updater has been detected. Keep holding the button down and click Open Hex File, then browse to and select the firmware we just downloaded. Finally, still firmly pressing the Upgrade button, click Flash Device. Be careful not to let go of the Upgrade button until the flash is complete. As you see here, you can perform a firmware update even if the port has a controller connected to it. That's all there is to it. Every port in the Blissbox foreplay has its own firmware, so be sure to repeat the process for all four ports to fully upgrade your unit. Once done, you can do whatever you want with the flash tool and firmware hex file. I like to store mine in my Hyperspin Utilities folder for archiving, testing, and later use. I like to take a quick test run after a firmware update. We can see here that the HBD 200's inputs are detected perfectly, so I know we're good to go. I hope you found this guide helpful and that the latest firmware helps enhance your enjoyment of gaming with the Blissbox Foreplay. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment below or you can contact Blissbox directly via the forums. Thank you and have a wonderful day.